Good evening, everybody. My name is Phil Ginsberg. I'm the general manager of your recreation and park department. Thank you. So, uh, my job can be challenging at times, but, but so on a night like tonight, I feel like the luckiest guy in the world to be here, to help, uh, to be here to support families and to host events like this. It's truly fantastic. And uh, this is the greatest city in the world and the greatest parks department in the world. Thank you all for joining us. So 82 years ago, Uncle John McLaren, our first park superintendent, started the tradition of lighting a mile-long stretch of trees on Fell Street, ending right here in front of McLaren Lodge, where he lived at the time. This behind you is the official tree of San Francisco, and it's called Uncle John's Tree. It is a Monterey Cypress that is 131 years old. It is over 100 feet tall. It has over 700 lights. It took eight Reckon Park tree toppers to put these lights up. And this is truly an incredible t tradition. And let's give a, a big round of applause honoring John McLaren, who'd be 160 today. So 82 years later, our staff has continued that tradition, and I want to thank all of the Rec and Park staff, everyone, our recreation staff, our tree toppers, our electricians, our park staff, our structural maintenance crew, everyone had a hand in planning this event tonight, and I want to make sure that the hardest working group of city employees is recognized for doing such a great job. So let's give it up for the Rec and Park staff. I also want to thank our city family who's here tonight, our great mayor, park champion and chief, Mayor Ed Lee, who you're going to hear from in a second. <laughs> Members of our board of supervisors, including Supervisor Farrell, Supervisor Ellsburn, Supervisor Wiener, I think Supervisor Marr is trying to park. <laughs> Supervisor Mercurimi is supposed to be here. I want to thank our great fire chief, Joanne Hayes-White, for being here today. I want to thank our police chief, Greg Sur, who was here a little earlier. Our treasurer, Jose Cisneros. Our great rec and park commissioners, Gloria Bonilla, Tom Harrison, Paige Arata, Megan Levitin, David Lee, and Commission President Mark Buell. Anna Damiani and Reese Isabel from Senator Mark Leno's office. Oh, Reese isn't here. Anna's here. Ashley Summers from Assemblywoman Fiona Ma is here. And I also want to thank very quickly our, our entertainers for the evening. We've had some incredible entertainment. We had the Golden Gate Park Band, the Parque Ninos Unidos Fairy Tale Frolic Class, the Hoover Middle School Jazz Band. The Burton High School Drum Corps. The Young People's Teen Musical Theater Company. The George Washington High School Marching Band. The Brunos. Prescott Circus. Park Service Area Manager Marianne Berticelli was playing music. And our own Rec Director Reed Fromer was here. And I now also want to thank our co-host for the evening, the newly formed San Francisco Parks Alliance. <laughs> Parks departments can't do it alone, and we need friends. And the Parks Alliance has really become our best friend. It's a merger of the Neighborhood Parks Council and the San Francisco Parks Trust. And I want to recognize their board chair, Rosemary Cameron, who's here. And our executive director, Matt O'Grady, is going to come up and say a few words and welcome us. Come on up, Matt. Thank you so much, Phil. So the San Francisco Parks Alliance is the new kid on the block, or maybe I should say the new kid here in the park. It's a brand new organization, and yet it's a very familiar organization because we come from the San Francisco Parks Trust and from the Neighborhood Parks uh, Council. 
these two organizations got together over the last year and realized that they could do so much more for our parks by combining forces and combining their efforts to make this park system the best recreation and parks and open space system in the world for San Francisco. I want to just give you a couple of examples of some of the, uh, uh, the great partnerships that we've built to make these parks so, so fabulous and so great in San Francisco. And the first partnership is with none other than the Recreation and Parks Department. It's called the Gear Up Program, where we've been working to raise money to provide uh, equipment and resources to our recreation centers citywide. And over the last couple of years, that program has raised from you, from your generosity, more than $300,000 for recreation centers across the city. Bravo to all of you for your, and thank you to all of you for your generosity. I want to mention another uh, partnership that we've had running through the San Francisco Parks Alliance. Take another look at this tree, this enormous, beautiful tree. Well, for all of the power of Mother Nature, trees like this don't get that way on their own. That tree started from a tiny little seed, and it grew to this beautiful majesty because of the, la the love and the care and the tender feeding and, and, and care that was provided to that tree over the last 130 years by our gardeners and our arborists. Every tree in every park in San Francisco, every plant, all of the beautiful landscaping that make our parks so beautiful, they are all that beautiful because of the gardeners and the landscape architects and the other professionals of our park staff who, who care for them every day and every night, 365 days a year. Well, where do our gardeners come from? I see a lot of young people here. Some of you might be interested in learning about how these plants grow and how we can nurture them and make them so beautiful for us. Well, we have a partnership with the Union Local 261 that developed an apprenticeship program to teach young people how to be the best gardeners in the world so that they can be become and join the staff of the Recreation and Parks Department and provide our future for parks uh, and for gardeners here in the city. So thank you to U uh, 261 and the, and the other unions who have been uh, such great partners with us. So I'm going to form another new partnership right here with all of you because uh, you may not know this, but today is some a very special person's birthday today. And some of you may not know this, but I got my start in, uh, in my career actually as a musician, as a conductor. And so I haven't done it in quite a while, but I am going to conduct all of you in singing happy birthday to none other than our very own Phil Ginsberg, who is 45 years old today. Phil, where'd you go? There you are. Please join me. Happy birthday to you. Many more. Thank you, Matt. Thank you, Matt. And Mr. Mayor, all I want for my birthday is about 50 more gardeners. <laughs> all right. Let's bring up our parks champion in chief, and he is everywhere in our park system. He's playing ping pong in Portsmouth Square. He's hanging out in ball fields at Cayuga Playground. He's in Golden Gate Park. He is everywhere. Ladies and gentlemen, our mayor, Ed Lee. Thank you, thank you. Phil, I thought all you wanted was your two front teeth. <laughs> thank you very much tonight, everybody, for coming here. It's wonderful to see so many families here together. This is the season where we celebrate with our family, our kids, to come together here. And I couldn't think of any place more wonderful to be here under this 100 30 years Cyprus to be here tonight and to share with you the kickoff and the lighting of this wonderful tree. I want to thank all of our department representatives here, our city's official family, our supervisors, elected officials for joining. I also want to let you know that it's kind of special. Uh, I came here last year and we saw painted on the side of this train was the World Series uh, Championship uh, emblem. And this year, 
We have painted on here uh, our San Francisco fire engine, fire engine uh, uh, station number 26, in tribute to our men and women of our fire department. And thank you for doing that. It's a wonderful tribute to our fire department. All of their sacrifice for the men and women that are there. And I want to thank the chief for coming here tonight, for helping us with the toy drive here, and for bringing the very special guest, somebody, Santa is here tonight. It's a special guest from our fire department. Isn't that wonderful? Thank you. Yeah, he's coming. He's on his way. I also wanted to let you know that in addition to tonight, on the weekend of December 17th and 18th, Reckon Park and City Hall and all of our officials want to welcome me here to Civic Center where we're going to have the snow village. Real snow coming to our Civic Center for all of you to play in. That weekend, isn't that nice? Yeah, you're going to have really snow. So come on in on Saturday and Sunday, the 17th and 18th. And then on that very same Sunday, the 18th, we'll also open City Hall. And you'll get to take the pictures with your family. We'll be there to take pictures if you want us there in your pictures alongside the Tree of Hope. The City Hall will be open from 11 to 4 p.m. that afternoon. So please come in and join us on the holiday season. Everybody's welcome. So thank you very much. And with that, all right, Mr. Mayor, are we ready? Let's, can we get all of our, our city family to stand up? Everybody what stand up. Why do you lead us in a countdown, all right. Mr. Mayor? How about a countdown beginning with 10, okay. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. Yeah. Happy holidays, everybody. All right, now if you listen very carefully, you're going to hear coming down the street, I think Santa's a coming, Mr. Mayor. <laughs> 